up subscribers and others. This is uh, my vacuum chamber. That's uh, the little ramekin in there. And that's um, some of the wax I already had. Um, that seemed like it was sparking or something. So, yeah, that pump's pretty loud, so I'll try to speak over it. But, um, let's see here. Uh, um, I don't know how hot it is because I don't have a thermometer, but the, the water's, I can touch it, you know, it's pretty hot. But the thing, uh, electric griddle is set at um, 250. So maybe it needs to go up a little more, but the vacuum chamber doesn't really fit, so I'm just kind of, I just kind of have it in the corner. But it's hot, I felt the bottom, but the ramekin needs to get hot, that's the problem. And I don't know if that bottom's hot yet, but it's ceramic. And that's something I bought at uh, Vaughn's grocery store. And um, it's cool because, uh, you know, they make creme brulee in those, so you bake them. So obviously that can withstand heat, but there's no vacuum. There's nothing going on yet. I'm pretty sure there's full vacuum on this, but maybe it's not hot enough. Looks like it's getting, it's kind of melting a little bit. Yeah, so I don't know. I'm new to the whole vacuum chamber deal and purging and all that. So if I got any results, I'll, sh I'll let you guys know. Thanks for watching. Herb and Grower Late.